The most important feature of the Oz lever hoist from the three quarter ton, the nine ton capacity, is that it comes standard with overload protection. At the factory, the hoists are triple tested at 50% above the rated capacity, and then the overload is set. This is how the overload works. We've got a, we're demonstrating here in a static load, so it's going to kind of come up to overload pretty quickly. So this is a 1,500 pound capacity, and I've got it in the up position and under tension. So as we're, as we're simulating that lift, you hear that clicking sound. And as we're, as we're raising a load, and as this load gets above the rate of capacity and into the overload, we're going to hear that that clicking sound has gone away. So at this point, you can continue to put as much pressure to this hoist, and you're not going to overload it or do any damage to the hoist, the product being moved, or most importantly, yourself. So the, the benefit of the overload is it takes the guesswork out of what's your weight of the load. If you didn't have overload, what would happen in this same scenario is as you're simulating your lift, at some point you're not going to be able to move the, the lever. And this is where some people would put a cheater pipe on and get a mechanical advantage and really pull until something bad happens. Usually hooks open up, chain elongates, and that's just not a good situation. So that overload is there to really protect you, the operator, in the event that you guessed wrong at the weight of the load. And the beauty of this overload is now that you've overloaded the hoist, you would put it in the neutral position. And again, you're not going to lose the load because the brake is still there holding the load. Put it into the lower position and go ahead and lower your load and go get a bigger hoist for the job in the event that it transitioned into the overload. The other great feature about this overload is that it never needs to be recalibrated. So now we can go ahead and put this hoist right back into service and it's good to go.